Hi, Catherine. I'm here with Vic at that house. So we walk out the back patio and this is our view. The house does face west, but we walked out the patio and now I'm just sitting, standing underneath the covered patio, which now that I am, see how warm it feels here. Yes. You would, de but they have an awesome. awning oh, right up here, an automatic awning. That's all right. uh, or maybe crank, I'm not sure, but that will definitely help in the summer months. Okay. Yeah. Is this uh, cement or is it that thermal? It's that cool decking, oh, which, cool. yeah. Is it okay? Yes, okay. and it looks like it's in good shape. So here, I mean, you don't have a huge view of the lake from the pool and the patio. Unless you maybe take out these big, two big pink bushes. You get a nice little view here. The pool looks beautiful. It's Pebble Tech. It's in great shape. Oh, there's the dock. It's really huge, huge ficus tree. And this is the side of the house. This is kind of nice back here. Yeah. I love the lushness. I feel like I'd want to sit on a bench and either take a nap or read a book. Yeah, this would be a good thing. <laughs> yeah. The AC looks like it's a newer unit. And then as we're on the side, wow, look at these roots. And then all the way at the end is where the dock is here. I mean, it's definitely not the same view as the other house, but you could sit out here in the evenings and really just feel like you're on the water. Nine years old. Oh, is it? Wow, that looks pretty in better shape than I thought. This tree's really messy. It's huge. I forgot what they call this one. Is that, is that a mesquite tree? Oh, that could be. Could be. I'm really not that good at those. Be. but I'm well, not either, but that does look like mesquite. Yeah. I mean, this is really hot over here right now. Yeah. And it's a beautiful day, but... These ducks are doing in here. I mean, this is a, basically a dead sea here. Right? I mean, it doesn't have any seaweed in there or anything. No, it's nothing. Just, just right. I mean, they stock it with fish. Oh, do they really? Oh, yeah, a ton. It's actually some of the best fishing um, in Arizona. This area has some of the best uh, oh. catch and release fishing. Really? Yeah, you'll see a lot of people, even along the golf courses, just throwing in and throwing back. But they have tilapia, catfish, and all in, kinds in of stuff this? in here. All of these lakes, all five of the lakes. Really? I have a great map of the lakes. I'm gonna to have to dig it out and show. Five. There's more lakes. Yes. Yeah, so there's it's Arrowhead Lakes, and not all of them are connected. So oh, there's five separate. Oh. One is called Sunset. One's called something else. And one of them is the largest one, that spans a few neighborhoods. So if you oh. have your boat, you could wander, you know, far. Oh, I didn't. Know I'll have to get you a there. copy of that. Um, Thought they were all dead. Yeah. No. And that's. I mean, if they were dead. This would really stink, right? I mean, that's what's keeping yeah, it. Of the algae. Yeah, because of the algae and everything. So this is a little green here, but um, that's why they have that aerator in the middle. Right. Right. Oh, 
Well, that's why they have the aerator for fish. Yeah. Yep.